Well, I got everything to thatch the other day. Check out that three point to thatcher video if you haven't seen it yet. I got 250 pounds here of a perennial rye and a, uh, a Kentucky bluegrass, a lot of varieties within there that make that up, but those are the two uh, seed blends that, uh, that make up this mix here. 250 pounds of that, I got three bags of starter fertilizer, and then I got five bags of Humichara soil amendment as well. So we got a lot of work for this three-point spreader here. This is the electric spreader. Great for ice melt pellets as well in the winter, not salt, but uh, put it on the back of your tractor, gator, whatever. They make a hitch mount version as well as this three-point. And if you haven't done so yet, hit that subscribe button right underneath the video. Read through the description as well. All sorts of helpful links down there to cool products for tractor owners. And check out the other videos on my channel.
So this is the seed I'm putting down right here. You know, this is going to be, again, a mixture of perennial rye, sissy grass sometimes called, or PRG, perennial rye grass. You're going to have uh, verde, or verte, perennial rye grass, commander street, perennial rye grass, and then uh, two different bluegrass blends here as well, shamrock and wild horse. You can see the the content mixture right there. So this is going to be the fertilizer, just a starter fertilizer here. You can see 1824-12 with your nitrogen, uh, phosphate, and potash in there too. So this right here is called Humachar. You can get this stuff on Amazon if you want to. It's a soil amendment. There's no actual fertilizer in here. You can see the contents right here, humic acids, uh, biochar as well, and then some other random stuff too. The cool thing about this is that it's spreadable, okay? A lot of these products here, you might have seen my video earlier this year where I put a... Um, a similar type of product in the in the spreader here it wouldn't spread and it just i ended up trying to cut it with some fertilizer and thin it out still wouldn't spread through and end up killing my grass as i kind of chucked it out and thought i was spreading it far enough and it just it didn't dissipate like i wanted it to do so this really makes quick work of tackling a lawn renovation project or just your lawn maintenance that you want to do throughout the year throughout the summer the good thing is you can still tackle uh, your ice melting pellets in here in the winter time so it kind of makes it a little bit more versatile that way the cool thing about this is that it's a uh, a variable speed control and so what that means is that you can adjust this dial right here this is the on off switch but you can adjust the dial to control the the pattern of spread from being very narrow to uh, i think it's 20 foot wide or maybe even wider than that so it's a pretty unique setup as far as that goes you still have to monitor how fast you're going your travel speed but i can tell you that i've kind of had that sweet spot for the most part that i uh, typically know how wide it's going to spread and then you have a gate control on the spreader itself so you kind of get a feel for just how fast to go and almost it becomes a second nature well thanks so much for watching if you haven't done so yet hit that subscribe button right underneath the video check that description as well for all sorts of helpful links where you can get this humachar and other cool products for your tractor and check out the other videos on my channel until next time stay safe we'll see you soon